well I'm in and I just want to show you guys these are beautiful they're $60 a piece but look at these lamps holy moly aren't they cool beautiful pair of lamps look at the look at the work on these isn't that gorgeous nice shades and everything all right just wanted to share I'm in all right let's check out the mishmash we've got our diapers here we have some markers some uh, photography paper streamers wooden acorn cute little knit hats these wall plates um, infantino baby holder uh, flower petals this is some kind of serving set with forks little serving set um faux candle big faux candle i don't know if the batteries are dead or not that's a nice size one especially for a candle ring and more printer paper filler paper binders tons of binders if you need binders come here if you need hair come here and right on cue we have some brenda har we have a mccall's pattern canvas kebab baskets uh, a lot of hanging file folders today a couple boxes full of them more diapers and more patterns here and let's see yeah nothing interesting there steno notebook uh, what is what is this this might be a mirror i can't open it up Right. Oh, I can. Oh, I don't know. Is this for us? Uh, no, I don't know what that's for. Gold's Gym sauna suit. Let's see what we have up here. A pro case for something. This is a whole set, like a bath set here, and this is 809 for this whole thing, and it comes in a wooden crate. That's pretty cool. And then we come down here, more hanging folders. More Brenda Har. Um, some party stuff, some napkins, notebooks, Brenda Har. Oh, some cards, scrapbooking stuff. Business card stock. I'll take that. I can use that for labels, for um, price labels. More Brenda Har. Be cool if there was more of that shower radio and that looks like shower radio buxton we have some venting stuff and more brenda har i'll probably look through to see if there's more of those business cards card stock it's just good to have a bunch more har Witch's hat, paper straws, photo albums. We got some nail polish down there. That's good to do enamel work if you want to touch up or upcycle some jewelry. Let me dig through these and see what's in here. Give me a second. I'll do that after I show you the rest here. Wallets, candles, more Brenda Har. The crazy colors are still here. Headphones, Brenda Har. Nerf guns. Okay, that is it here for the mishmash. Okay, we're here in the art aisle. They did pull a lot. Uh, it looks like my picture is finally gone, and this is the week, the day that it would have been half off. So, um, oh well, it's okay. It wasn't meant to be, unless it's hidden somewhere, but I have no idea. We have a uh, Mardi Gras here. This is a cute picture over here. Let me take you over here really quick and show it to you. That is adorable. We have a clock. A lot of document frames here. Pretty shoe. And let's see what else we've got here. A little sculpture in a shadow box. We have a giraffe. Welcome to our home. Somebody's colored artwork. And yeah, there's a lot of big, big pieces here. 
yeah, I think mine is gone, the one that I wanted. That's okay. I didn't need it. But I said if it was still here on half price day, I would get it. And it's not, so. It's a little, little fashion ladies there. Kind of got a black dahlia look to it. I'm trying to show you down here. Very cute. Shopping ladies. And that's it over here for the art. Here we are in the metal aisle. Let's see if there's anything interesting. We have some molds here. It's a nice jewelry holder. Too small for what I need though. There's some kind of little case. Let's see what's in here. 409 and it's, oh, it's for cooking for on, on the grill. That's cute. Nice gift for somebody. Uh, and light up and, and, here are those things that you can, uh, when you're planting stuff, you put the name of the plant on it. Two oh nine. I don't know why that isn't a dollar nine. It's a clock, a tin. The football mold is still here. Christmas tree stands are still here. Um, here you go. Professional deep muscle full body massage gun. My goodness. How about that? Nine bucks for that. That'll stay. Food warmer. We still we have some cake molds and we still have those uh, Christmas uh, Santa trays. And I'm looking up here to see if there's anything. Neat sculpture down there. That's the thing that looks like it holds a million ties. If that's what it's for. Reindeer food bucket, that's adorable. Another mold. We have more travel mugs up here. And a couple of miscellaneous Christmas stuff. They emptied out the Christmas uh, miscellaneous aisle. They took a lot of stuff out of there. And I think that would be it. We'll look over here at the mugs, but that is it for the metal if you haven't already done so please subscribe to my channel hit that like leave a comment under the video um, and when you do subscribe hit that notification bell and set it to all so you don't miss on anything I also sell stuff on my channel so you can check that out when I have my live sales or pre-recorded sales and also pin to the top comment under every thrift with me video is a link to the playlist of all my thrift with me videos and you can go back and find some really cool stuff so go check that out if you have a chance and to the new subscribers, thank you so much. I do offer memberships as well if you are a buyer. Okay, I'll be back. Okay, we have the mugs here. And the pitchers and the glasses and the wine glasses and the champagne glasses and the bottles and these funky looking things. Um, looks like they emptied this out. There were some couple cool pieces, but they were damaged, so I left them behind. And those are a cool color, I like those, but I don't need them. And let's see, some inspirational mugs. It says, actually, I can, and then inside it says, and I will. Then you have believe in yourself, and then a star. I don't know who makes these. Love something, love language probably, or something like that. We have these copper ones and then the polka dot and the striped ones back there, which probably all went together on a tower. Sun will. And we have a aquatic theme one, and this is ooh, Georgia Aquarium. That's cool. For a dollar nine. That's nice, they're all raised up. That's a pretty pretty cool uh, mug. And let's see, Margarita, that's somebody's name. Nice vintage mug, and here's one with an M on it. That's pretty. Okay. And an owl, and an elf, and a polar bear, and a bear bear, and a chicken. Espresso yourself is now chipped. And let's see what we have over here. What is this? Plain Peoria. They wiped it out here. They pulled stuff. This would have been good. It's a um, Taz 
but he's chipped, so I'm not going to get him, unfortunately. Uh, Precious Moments one over there. Love cannot break a true friendship. And that will be it for here. All right, we're here in the plates and the dishes and, and uh, that kind of stuff. And we'll see what's here. These are milk glass plates. Ooh, they have like a satiny finish on the on the bottom of them. That's pretty interesting. I don't know if there's anything here. They did pull a lot of stuff. Here's some little luster bowls. They're very cute. 309 for one, two, three, four, five of them. Those are kind of cool to use as candy dishes. I don't know. We'll think about that. They're cute. Whoops. Sorry, Sorry Brian. And we'll see what else is down here. We have a jar, some more dishes. That's kind of pretty with the pine cone pattern on it. $4.99 for that. And uh, we have a traffic jam here, so hold on, I'll be back. All right, we're over here. This is a nice little covered dish. I can't get it out because it's piled too high here. We have some more mugs. Uh, little saucers. Oh, that's cute. Cameron and Aiden. And with their footprints, they made them look like little mistletoes. Get it? Because it's their toes. That's so cute. And we have that dish is still here. The art pottery. And I'm looking under here to see if there's anything else. To show you and it doesn't really look like it it's pretty bland here um, I think that's about it for the dishes and plates not much not much to speak of today so we will keep moving on all right so this is the um, miscellaneous and holiday aisle and it is empty they emptied it out or people emptied it out when they bought stuff i don't know there's a cute bunny up there there's a nutcracker uh fairy ballerina she's kind of cool we'll see what's up with her we'll check her out and see who makes her um some reads it's hard because the speaker's right over me so i'm hopefully gonna uh bypass the speaker and talk loud enough that uh oh this is still here remember i put this back last week or the week before and there's still only one so unless that's the other one that they finally put out but you can see how oh there's another okay i picked one precious moments and there were actually two here oh there's a creepy clown right next to her let's not Infinity series. I don't know who makes Exploded View stainless steel tumbler. Okay, and um, look how empty it is, guys. It's crazy, huh? And we have a gnome here. That's fine. I got plenty of gnomes I need to get rid of. International Bazaar. These look like snow globes for the 12 days of Christmas. And here's some bottle brush trees there. And some cup hooks, but you could get this stuff, you know, the, the Dollar Tree when you actually need it. But that's about it for here. It's kind of empty. Okay, we're going to be moving on because it's too loud over here. So this guy's adorable. He's a little hedgehog and he's made of Cecil and other natural things. Look at him. Isn't he great? He is very cute. His ear is kind of loose though. I don't want to lose his ear. He's adorable. I think I might get him too. He's very, very cute. I like him. Okay, we're here in the wood. Oh, is this another wool hat? Yes, it is. I keep getting the wool hats for that, that girl. Um, these are the baskets. How much is this basket? $4.09. That's a cool basket. I like the fibers they use for it. So I'll, ch I'll check through here really quick to see if there's anything interesting. But right now we're going to look at the wood. And we have some candles, some picture frames, bowls. I um, don't know what that is. Uh, it's for books. 
that poor pitiful tree still here and there's a little church storage thing and we have Christmas countdown kits more picture frames and shadow boxes that's a nice shadow box for 209 these are quite expensive when you get them at the craft stores trick-or-treat uh, llama we have a one duck um, bookend here we have a pineapple cute houses what is this it's a book that they made something with well that's cute that goes you could put that across the top of your um, of your doorway that'd be a cute decoration for there Seville Classics. I don't know what that's for. Not sure what that would be. Uh, it's picking up a lot of people in here, so it's going to be harder to film. Uh, we have the lunch, the picnic basket, and more inspirational signs about family and such. And like a gnome turkey over there. And that's about it. This looks this looks older. It's not. It's cute. It's got um, Velcro on the back of it. And what does this say? It's my kitchen and I'll fry if I want to. Okay. And we got these nice shelves here. That is about it. I'm going to check out the baskets really fast and see what we have. All right. I don't see anything that really stands out to me uh, here for the baskets. They're pretty empty too. They're usually a lot more full. A lot of people fill them as gift baskets, so uh, they do a lot of craft projects. So it's a good place to get baskets at an affordable price. But I'm not really seeing anything that I'm interested in here for the baskets. So I think we're going to keep going, guys. That one's really cool, though. That one intrigues me, but I have enough baskets. So we're here in the knickknacks, and we'll see if we can find anything here. That's pretty nice. I think it's a napkin holder. That's pretty fancy schmancy. We have a little red truck with the tree on it for your lotion and your soap. We have a wooden, no, it's a hollow apple. More of these um, ball mason jars with the lids on them. That's kind of cool, the kind of lids they have. Those are neat. I like them. Uh, there's one back there. There's a cobalt color candle stick holder. Black cherry scented candles. The praying children are still here. Here's a little um, soap dish. These are pretty too. Blue glass. Dollar nine each. They have a nice texture to them. Nice texture. Those are pretty with the fake succulents with the dragonflies. Those are kind of nice. You have some coral here that somebody painted. There's still some clowns here, but some people actually bought some, so that's good. I don't have to look at them that much. <laughs> and some planters. And another cross down there. Big platters down here. And Eek is still here. And an owl we have. That's a pretty lotus flower candle, uh, like a pillar candle holder. That's 509, so we're going to leave that alone. And we're going to look through here. More blue glass, very nice. Uh, cute wire basket, 309 for that, like a little egg basket. Uh, those don't sell well for me. I still have a couple in my booth, so... All right, we have a nice swan here, but it's got a chip on it right there. And here's what's left of the clowns. It looks like some new ones they brought out too since I was here last week. That's an oldie. That's an oldie for the clowns. And more glasses and art pottery. Uh, those look homemade. They're all scratched up, the coasters. And we have a cute little watering can here. A wooden shell. Another pillar candle. 
We still have a lot of these uh, Treasures of the Heart figurines, but not as much as it was here last week. And I think that's it for this side. And then we'll look at the other side. Okay, here's the other side. It's usually not as exciting as the other, the opposite side. They have a few of these. These are nice, but they're newer, more contemporary. That's a pretty little container too. Um, a cow thing. I don't know what it is for. I don't know. I think it looks like it uh, should have had a lid to it. These are toll crystal candlestick holders. Again, those don't go well for me, so I don't pick them up. They might go well for somebody else. And again, I show you more of what's here, even if it's stuff I'm not interested in, uh, to show you what's out here. Some people can't come out and, and go to Goodwill. Some people don't have Goodwills. That's a neat vase. That's a nice vase. That's pretty cool. 209 for that. Don't need it though. But that should go. That's really, really pretty. Nice modern shape to it. Poor elephant's still here. The chip gnome is still here. Oh, the wine bottles are still here. That's a nice big yellow vase there. And if it was a swung vase, I would have grabbed that in a split second. This, I think, is made out of alabaster or marble. It's 309. I don't know what the divider is for on it. That's a cool texture vase. Another bottle brush tree. What is that? Spaghetti. That's a nice spaghetti holder. Fancy schmancy. Shishi la la. Oh my goodness. And then vases if you need them for projects. They always have them here as, as usual. So I have to edit down my cart. Uh, a lot of it is wool hats. So, don't let the fullness of it fool you. Alright, I don't know if I missed any aisles. Well, I'm going to think about where I went already. So, I'm over here by the pillows and pillowcases and stuff. Check out this pillow. That's so cute. Look at the cats. I don't know who makes it, but it's cute. It's two ninety nine. I did grab two pillows I might be getting. Uh, this is like mossy oak stuff. That's some kind of quilt. It looks like a sheet for um, Pinocchio. Uh, there's all sorts of mix of stuff, but you don't know what the stuff is in here. I don't see anything else that... Uh, I already looked at the other section. It was like half empty. Ooh, look at this. These are silk. They're $1.99 each. And we have these ribbon trees. Aren't they pretty? Those are $2.99 each. There's two of them. I don't know if the other one's in better shape. That one's in a little bit better shape. My mom used to make those. But that's it over here for the textiles. That's an, oh, that's a big old curtain. Looks like a blackout curtain. If you want to darken a room. But that's it for over here. Over here, they have some old embroidery machines we have one there we have one there and there's one uh down at the end over there but not necessary oh teak 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 that's nice i don't see any speakers for it though and then we have for twenty dollars a kenwood multi-compact disc player very cool and we have some coffee makers and mixers and radios and stuff like that oh there's the kenwood dual cassette right there and the receiver so somebody uh donated the, the whole setup so cool all right that's it for over here just wanted to show you guys this really pretty dress it's a plus size dress and it's got flowers on it it's really really pretty look at that in the back has the uh, lace-up corset on it. It's $13, but how? That's pretty. I don't know what size it is. It looks like it's um, looks like it's homemade. Oh, I'm gonna look and see. All right, I didn't see a price on. I mean, I didn't see a size on it, but it caught my eye. Kind of neat. A little over the top, but that's okay. There's some really funky patterns here on some of these dresses. 
Um, this one's got a tie-dye look to it. Oh, it's like a jumpsuit. That's pretty cool. All right, I got to get out of this section. I'm right under a speaker. Well, they just put out this kitty cat Squishmallow. I can't remember his name, but uh, he's a ginger cat. And he's 309, but I'm not going to get him. So hopefully some kid, some kid will get him and like him. Oh, look at the owl. How cute. Don't need any more plush, though. I need to have a plush sale on my channel. And again, guys, if you haven't already done so, please subscribe to my channel. Hit that notification bell. Set it to all. Hit the like on the video and leave a comment below the video. Also pinned to the first comment right under the video is a playlist link to all my Thrift With Me videos. And uh, go back go back some months and see the kind of stuff I used to get. Pretty awesome. Pretty awesome. Um, don't just watch the recent ones. Oh, you want a pizza me? <laughs> I got it. Hey, you want a pizza me? That's cute. That is cute. Okay. I'm going to be doing the cart review shortly. All right, I'm putting the uh, the fairy nutcracker back. She would have been 209, but that's okay. She's going back. Give her to somebody else. And these Ray Dunn Coast, they're milestones, it says. They're made by Ray Dunn, and it's, you know, uh, it says for a baby. Like, it's every month. There's one for every month. Um, this one has 13 in it, so I don't. I'm not going to get it. I don't think this is anything anybody's going to really want. So I'm going to put that back too. I'm putting these back too. They are salt and pepper shakers. They're plastic. Um, they apparently talked at one time, but they look pretty corroded. I wouldn't, I wouldn't give that a, uh, uh, it's not worth the risk, but, um, cute salt and pepper shakers. Um, but I'm putting them back. Don't need them. Don't want to mess with cleaning terminals for corroded, uh, battery compartments. So they're going back. All right, I'm putting this figurine back too. It's clay. She's really cute. She's got some chipping around the edges. Um, Dollar nine. It's like redware clay. Really cute, but um, I'm not going to get it. I don't think anybody's going to be interested in that. So I'm going to give it, leave this for somebody else. All right, I'm also going to put this Tervis mug back. It's a 30 ounce, or it's really cool looking, 309. But uh, I really don't need that either. Uh, I think we're going to do the review after this. Let me go put this back and I'll get right back to you. And I just spotted this. It's the Queen Mother. It's a Mary Inglebright piece. But I don't do good with these either. So we're going to put this back on the shelf. But it's cute. Alright, I just had to show you guys. I got a sort of a grail item for me. This is the Marty Moose um, from Christmas Vacation that he drank the eggnog out of from Christmas uh, Vacation. So uh, this is going to be a keeper, I believe, but I'm so excited about that. You have no idea. That is so cool. And I got a little house hippo too. I, I happen to be here by the door when they come out with the carts. So I just stopped Brian and I got it. But yes, I finally got one. Yep, that's official. Very cool. So I am in line to check out, but woohoo, I'm happy about that. Always wanted one. It's not even plastic, it's glass. Okay, guys, I'm going to do the recap here. Um, I'm going to get the swan, the glass swan, uh, Ray Dunn, little ornament, little decor, uh, Grogu. I'm going to get the hedgehog. Hopefully his ear won't disappear by the time I get out of here. He's adorable. Uh, a hummingbird mug. Very pretty hummingbird mug. I don't think there's anything wrong with it. I got the paper straws. I'm going to get these luster bowls because they're just really pretty and you get five of them. So I'm going to get those. Then I'm going to get these two awesome quilted skull pillows. I forget the brand. The brand's inside. I unzipped it and saw the brand. Um, this gorgeous peacock scarf. I'm going to try to hang it up here so you can see it. Gorgeous peacock scarf absolutely beautiful it's not gonna stay <laughs> there we go you get it more of an idea of it. it just wants to slip down I'm gonna get the singer sewing machine tin which is really cute it's got singer on it's got a little dent in it but I think I can fix that uh, very very cute I'm getting all these felt hats 
for the girl that uh, one of my buyers at the antique mall booth um, she's looking for the wool hats so I'm getting more for her two precious moments hopefully these can sell on my channel I do sell stuff on my channel uh, precious moments doll so I have that one and I have the Uncle Sam one then we have some shirts I got this one and it says Giovanni and it says Giovanni I believe this is already spoken for um, and it says Giovanni on there as well I got a Hello Kitty t-shirt here Hello Kitty and friends very cute and I do believe I have a person who collects peanuts and Snoopy so I'm gonna pick up this shirt it's got the Snoopy on it uh, I got a handprint kit which is plaster I'm getting another one of these little mix-up guys I'll be bringing them up for maybe in a couple days for sale this is a talking pet starter set if you ever saw the videos on those um, I think she's the goddess of mercy she's got a little food dog there statue so that's a cool piece I'm getting that I'm getting the finger puppets, the Rudolph Red Nosed Reindeer. Uh, that's so cute. I just love that. Some Prang Metallic Markers. I need them a shot. Getting two of these um, 1994 McDonald's Thai uh, dinosaurs. And then a couple more regular beanies. And I'm getting a couple things for the cats. Mouse just loves rubbing on these bristle things. So I'm getting this one, and I'm getting this one, and these um, are like fingers in the air, and then they pull down on them to play with the balls. Balls, balls, balls. So I'm getting them for my guys. So that's about it. Um, if you haven't already done so, please subscribe, hit that notification bell, set it to all. Leave a comment below, give us a like, and uh, check out that link. That's the first comment under the video. That is a playlist to all my Thrift With Me videos, and they go back a ways, so check them out do a binge watch get some coffee and watch me a thrifting um love to hear from you guys in the comments uh let me know your favorite thing that i showed or that i got today i'd like to know just put it in the comments and let me know your favorite thing so but uh yes a lot of this stuff will be showing up at my variety sales on my channel so thank you for watching everybody hope you have a great day and until next time see you on the flip side Bye, everybody. Thank you for watching. See you again soon. Bye.